I'm Mike Goldman, and yes, we're back. Join me, Bree, and Fitzy for the grand debut of Friday Night Live for 2008 in just 30 minutes. It's out of this world night. But first, tears, tricks, and tantrums in another drama packed episode of The Daily Show. If you <laughs> could date anyone in this house, I wouldn't. You wouldn't? I'd date you if I had to. Yeah. Tonight on Big Brother, Boys Club, meet the Spa Mafia. Uh, but Travis need not apply. Travis is a notable absence from the Mafia. Yes. And Dixie already talking about leaving. I'm going. It's after nine in the morning and Dixie wants her breakfast. She's been keeping a vigil by the food conveyor to make sure nothing spills off the end when Big Brother finally sends in the morning's offering. In the bedroom, there's now the familiar scene of Bridget clutching her sleeping companion, a white stuffed unicorn she calls Princess Sparkles. She can't go to bed without her. Does it, your brain, you'd be smarter if you read more, hey? So I should read, I really should read. That's not you necessary. Don't. Well, you don't, I don't think if you were to read more, you'd be But I'm be bad smarter. with words. Like, I don't... My biggest word is like because... Like your vocabulary. Yeah, my vocab's just Reading boring. would definitely in, yeah, improve but, that. Yeah, reading can improve the vocab. My biggest word is because, and I don't even say because, I say cause. <laughs> okay. Wait, cause this. <laughs> Let, OK, let's... We'll start off small and we'll... I'll give you a word each day. Well, I need to know how to use it and how to no, spell it. And you've got to use that in a... Like, you've got to use... That's your word for the day, so you've got to use it as, as many much times as, you can. as you can. I'll give you a word. Audacity. Right, we got, um, I think it's worth because we've got to start out <laughs> Let's, uh, well, I've got to say what you said. Audacity. 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 Yeah, it means, um, how, what does it mean again? <laughs> Audacity just means rude, like if you Not were to... Not rude, like, um, how dare you? Yeah, like, this is how you would use it, or how could you have the audacity to speak to me in that way? Yeah. Oh my god, are you for real? I'd rather just be like, Oi, who are you to speak to me like that? <laughs> <laughs> Oi, who are you? Oi! Oi, get up your high horse, who are you? You are not good, don't you speak to me like that? I reckon we start maybe audacity. That, I reckon, do you want to go with audacity? audacity or do you want to go with no, something? No, I like the word, but I don't know how. I'll have to get into an argument to use it. Yeah, oh, I'm sure you will. <laughs> I'm sure you I'm will. I'm going to go out there and start trouble. Yeah, do it. Problem child. <laughs> and Brecky. Give us another word, shoot. I don't want to overload you, man. Go, give me give me one. Critique. 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 Like Crit C R I T. Critique. 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 I gotta I, I can say that one better. Or does it mean? Critique. It's to analyse or um, critique. It's to judge something. If I was to critique that, um, those rings, I would say those rings are symbolic of the Olympics that are going to be held in Beijing this year and that they represent that... We've lost her. <laughs> <laughs> we, we've lost her? Okay, it means my eyes are going, what? That just says nothing about the Olympics to me. That's yeah. just funky art. <laughs> I can just walk up and go, that looks cool. <laughs> Is that me being cryptic? No, that's you being simple. Oh, that's <laughs> me being simple. I like that. That's no, that's funny. you being simple. <laughs> <laughs> the boys minus Travis have formed a clique that meets regularly in the spa. 
They call themselves the Spa Mafia, and this morning two of its henchmen, Ben and Saxon, are off to tell Big Brother about a kidnapping that they're planning. <coughs> Big Brother. Saxon, Ben, very entertaining. I'd like to record myself as MCB. Yes. This is MC Sax. What's up? Tell Big Brother about your plans. For Operation Sparkle. Operation Sparkle is, is um, this was created by the Spa Mafia, and uh, it entails us somehow stealing um, one of Bridget's cherished teddy bears. What steps will your plan involve? I mean, I just broke a bit of a decoy. I think there's going to have to be a decoy. Mm -hmm. maybe, a watch, a lookout. Maybe a bit of framing, just to. Um, it has to be framing. Whom are you planning to frame? Dixie. Yeah, mate. I reckon Dixie. Because there seems like there's a bit of tension between them already. <laughs> yeah. mm. Pretty late. Sorry, mate. You were here. Yeah. Oh, God. Next, the plot to pinch Princess Sparkles continues. Tell Big Brother about the Spa Mafia. It just ended up happening that um the boys need the boys need a special time. I don't I'm not meaning to interrupt you by the way. <laughs> the boys need a special time and a special place where only the boys can come and we can talk things that we don't want the girls listen to about. We've named it the Spa Mafia and we talk about all a range of things. What's wrong with this chair? Talk about a range of things from um I don't know, who we getting along with, who we're not getting along with, and we're all as part of the Spa Mafia, that's where we came up with the old um, Operation Sparkle. Travis is a notable absence from the Mafia. Yes. I think he's a mole. <laughs> <laughs> I, think he'd, I think he'd tell the women what we... If we were planning Operation Sparkles, I reckon Bridget would know about it. Um, I, think he's un, I think we can't trust him. Yeah, well, it's, it's starting to seem like he's... Um, he's, he's siding... It's not, it's not like we're two different groups, but it feels Hence like... That's the whole theory. He's siding with the girls over the guys. Yeah, I thought it would come, because it's labelling you, you should have a name. You've got a name. <laughs> if you could date anyone in this house... I wouldn't. You wouldn't? No, no I'd not, no. If you could or had to? If you could. No one. No, I wouldn't. By no. choice, I wouldn't. By choice, I wouldn't. Okay, okay, well, you had to choose someone. Okay, so we're stuck in here, we have Can to repopulate. No, not, not even like mate. I'd date you if I had to. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thanks, Beck. You make it if I had to. I'd not date a... you because I know you wouldn't try and pin me down first night. No. Ah! Yeah. I think you'd be a real gentleman. Yeah. I'm not, not, I'm not nice enough to have a nice bloke like you. Who would you say? Oh. You're a nice chick. Personality or what's going on? Go look at the pro at Div. But I think he'd be a listener. He's not too. Oh yeah, no. He Chirpy. wouldn't talk to. Yeah, he's. Mm. Okay, shoot. No, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Let me think about it now, because I'm, I'm strategizing. You're a marriage material man. Mm. That's what I. Really yeah, mean. you're a keeper. But mm. I'm, when you say who would you, who you don't have enough bad boy. I'm not a bad. I'm not bad enough. Yeah. After we've been on a drink, we can never look at it again. No. <laughs> Someone has to tell Travis. That's how you get it. Yeah, yeah we'll tell Travis. Because it, it'll be spam half your room. Spam half your room. Alright, this is it. Alright, spam half your room. I'm really liking these little pink tails. Oh. <laughs> 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 Travis, Bridget, Dixie. Big brother, can we please have some sort of an animal in here? Please. Could we get a little puppy? I think everyone misses their animals from home. Even a pig. <gasps> yeah, a miniature pig. A pig would be funny. It would be good. 
And we could sleep. He could come in the bed too. It is my pig so we can put it into bacon. In the absence of pets, are there any items in the house you take particular comfort in? Well, I have one regular teddy bear. We named it, we decided to call it BB. Beautiful, Beautiful bear. Beautiful bear. And it's like Big Brother. And then I have a unicorn toy and its name is Princess Sparkle. And I can't sleep without them. Yeah, it'll be a good time to get sparkles. And then I'll get stashing something. Oh, that's a long period. Oh, shit. Why don't I just go and stash him in my locker now? Yeah, and then bring it out. Yeah. And I'm just going to just grit him out for a piss. Rima, Rima, Mike. This is great. Next, dinner is served, and for Rima, it's green cuisine. I like seaweed. Bridget works off some excess energy before dinner, not knowing that David is acting out the next step in Operation Sparkles. If I get a shit in it tonight, it'll push me yeah. over the edge. I but I like it. I get think up it and leave. I'm trying to get over this maybe. Tonight's dinner is another lottery. Pick a number and get the corresponding meal. Some housemates are happy, others are not. Dixie, who's been hungry all day, is anxious to see what Big Brother has in store for her. Think positive. Everyone give a good thought. Think positive. Meal number nine. Seaweed. Seaweed. Oh. Yeah, let it. I'm not. Don't. I'm not touching it. Stop somewhere. It. It'll actually. It'll stop when it gets to the light. It smells pretty yuck, but I would eat it. That's what That's you said right. yesterday. Right. Meal up. number ten: an authentic Indian oh, curry oh. with mouth-watering trifle oh. and a glass oh. of white wine. Bad, then it's not a lot of it's, yeah, it's selective. Are you okay? I can't believe I'm crying over food, but I'm uh, it's sound it's sound cool. Meal number 11. A bowl of prunes. I like prunes. Do you like prunes? Do you like prunes? Big Brother will allow one housemate to swap a meal with another housemate. I'll, I'll give Oi. mine up, but I don't know who to give it to. I will give this up. Dix, do you want this? Hey, listen. Dix, listen. 
No, I'm, I'm going to give my meal up to either. But who had one? Like, who had a good meal last night? Hang on, what would you like to? Hang on, because I like seaweed. You like yeah, seaweed? Yeah, but hang on, we, only one person can do it. Yeah, we'll. Yeah, Are we allowed to eat? Do you honestly like seaweed? seaweed? I love seaweed. Oh, I that's, love it. That's good. Oh, that's great. There's can we eat? Are we allowed to start yeah, eating? I'm not saying it's me. This is Big Brother. Housemates, bon appetit. Thank you. Thanks, big brother. That's all we have, Rogers. Beautiful. Ben, <laughs> isn't this like. What about the fish to Jackson in the end? One person. Some sort of. They're healthy, though. Laxative, yes. Yeah. No, I mean, like, a meat, like, illegal to give me all this for dinner. Yeah, because you can't eat it. Don't eat it. sick as a dog. If no one would have swapped with me tonight, they would have pushed me over my limit. I would have went in there and requested to go home. You would not. I, I'm, I'm that dead serious. You reckon they would? You can't say you would have left because of that. I probably, I reckon I would have been, I would have. Oh, look, I, I started crying in there. Yeah. If no one swapped with me and I was still crying, I would have went in there and said, no, nah, f*** you. I'm going. I've eaten. Did you eat? Yeah, come in. <laughs> I've got a real bad luck of run, run of luck coming. I mean, 38 proves. <laughs> fourth day and I've already cracked. <laughs> I can't believe I started crying about it. Yeah, I can't believe you started crying about it as well, to be honest with you. After the break, Princess Sparkles goes missing. Ah! Someone stole my unicorn. I'm sensitive like you. I would have been. I wish I didn't cry in front of everyone. Don't worry now. about it. No one thinks anything <laughs> stupid. Don't like worry. I promise you. I'm such. I, I don't. I'm not all that. Like I don't know. I was just hungry and I just needed a decent meal. You know this is no no girls out here tonight wanting to play games. Mm. Yeah. Oh yeah, mate. Hmm? Bridget mightn't say anything, I don't think, if she discovers it tonight. Oh, she might not. I reckon she just might not say anything. She's got to have noticed by now. So what, what's the plan from here? Leave it all day tomorrow and all night? Oh, let's let, let the good times roll. Honestly, if Rima didn't stop me, I would have went in there and I said, look, I'm going to you, get my stuff, I'm going. I would have went. Well, I don't want you to go. I wouldn't have let you. I would have chased you into the toilet. <laughs> this is going to make you stronger. You feel, but do, do you feel, do you feel, still feel sick now? Yeah, I feel more sick now. Someone stole my unicorn. Bianca, Bianca and I have got bites. Bed yeah, it's like a bed bug or something. Who has my unicorn? What's the unicorn? And when it's gone? Sparkles. Oh, sparkles. Princess Sparkles. Well, it's not there. Oh, no! You can't get hickeys. <laughs> It's not too spicy. I'm the same, yeah. Just from kissing? Yeah. Just from kissing? You have to be like a good. But that would leave a mark up there. Yeah. I'm pretty gone. I'm pretty positive I didn't bring it outside. I think Big Brother stole it. What'd you say? I'm, I'm happy to have the lights on. Oh, you mean these lights? Yeah. He yeah, turns yeah. the outer ones off yeah. first. Oh, yeah. Can't you find it? Did you ask Big Brother? Have you had it any? No, I didn't. I've already it outside at all. No, I just looked out there. Have you had it anywhere else? No. Today? I'm going to ask Big Brother. No, no, no. She met a guy. She's very like Cody. 
do you think someone took it? Like, they would have told you back. Yeah, I don't think anyone would have taken it. Bridget. Hi, big brother. Um, I was just wondering, did you take my unicorn toy? Big brother does not kidnap oh. fluffy toys. Big brother is more concerned with the welfare of the housemates. Yeah, I know, but I can't sleep unless I have it, and that's my welfare, and I'm a housemate. I can't stand Bridget. She drives me crazy. Really? Yeah. I have to say it, she's just so mm -hmm. stupid. <laughs> I'm the first one to bitch. She's just playing on a dumb axe and I have no, nothing in common with her apart from the fact I like to dress up and look good. And that's it. She does not stimulate my brain and she's driving me nuts. Bridget. Yes? If you had a message for Sparkles, what would it be? It would be, go back to your pillow where I left you. And if you've gone somewhere, um, like out of the house, then could you send me some sort of a message to let me know you're okay? She's got nothing interesting that I want to talk about. Sparkles, okay. teddy bear, and just. Mm. I'm always happy to get up and have a look for because a she, sparkle thing. Yeah, yeah. But yeah then that's... I got sick of it. And I was like, oh, <laughs> oh, doll. I hate bitching and I don't want this to be a bitch session. I just needed someone to would talk to. Would you like to, to practice? You? Would you like to anger you? Would you like no, to? No, I just needed someone to talk to, that's all. That's good. Do you feel good now that can? you've let it all out? <laughs> yeah. What did... What? He told me... He, she, he told me she probably doesn't like me anymore and went to find a new owner. <laughs> Is that what he said? <laughs> oh, that's terrible. I know! <laughs> Everyone's pretty excited about the games, I reckon. I can't see myself winning. I'm a competitive person, I like to win. Mind over matter and I always think positive and I, yeah, I reckon I'll go pretty good. Let the games begin. The 2008 debut of Friday Night Live is next. Tell Big Brother about the Spa Mafia. It just ended up happening that um, the boys need the boys need a special time. I don't. I'm not meaning to interrupt you, by the way. <laughs> the boys need a special time and a special place where only the boys can come and we can talk things that we don't want the girls listening to about. We've named it the Spa Mafia and we talk about all a range of things. What's wrong with this chair? Talk about a range of things from um, I don't know who we getting along with, who we're not getting along with, and we're all. As part of the Spa Mafia, that's where we came up with the old um, Operation Sparkle. Travis is a notable absence from the Mafia. Yes. I think he's a mole. <laughs> <laughs> I, think he'd, I don't think he'd tell the women what we... If we were planning Operation Sparkles, I reckon Bridget would know about it. Um, I, think he's un, I think we can't trust him. Yeah, well, it's, it's starting to seem like he's... Um, he's, he's siding... It's not, it's not like we're two different groups, but it feels Hence like... That's the whole theory. He's siding with the girls over the guys. Yeah, I thought it would come, because it's labelling you, you should have a name. You've got a name. <laughs> if you could date anyone in this house... I wouldn't. You wouldn't? No, no I'm not, no. If you could or had to? If you could. No one. No, I wouldn't. By no. choice, I would By wouldn't. choice, I would 
Okay, okay, well, you had to choose something. Okay, so we're stuck in here and we have Can to you repopulate. Me, my sonny? No, not, not even like mate. I'd date you if I had to. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thanks, Beck. You make it if I had to. I'd not date a... you because I know you wouldn't try and pin me down the first night. Yeah. <laughs> I think you'd be a real gentleman. Yeah. I'm not, not, I'm not nice enough to have a nice bloke like you. Who would you say? Uh, You're a nice chick. Personality or what's going on? Go look at the co-act, Div. Okay, I forgot that three days. No, 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 I'm not a bad. I'm not bad enough. Yeah. After we put you on a drink, we can never look at it again. No. <laughs> Someone has to tell Travis. That's how you can do it. Yeah, we'll tell Travis. Because it, it'll be fun half your room. Yeah, when we get done, it'll be fun. All right. All right. Fun half your room. I'm really liking these little pink tails. Travis, Bridget, Dixie. Big brother, can we please have some sort of an animal in here, please? Could we get me down the first night? <laughs> ah! <laughs> I think you'd be a real gentleman. Yeah. I'm not. Ni I'm not nice enough to have a nice bloke like you. Who would you say? Uh, You're a nice chick. Personality. Or what's going on? Go look. Go look. Go look. Go look. Go no, 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 you're a marriage material man. Mm. That's what I agree Yeah, with. you're a keeper. But mm. I'm, when you say who would you hook you up with you? don't have enough bad boy. I'm not, a bad, I'm not bad enough? Yeah. After we put you on a drink, we can never look at it again. No. <laughs> Someone has to tell Travis. That's how you can do it. Yeah, yeah we'll tell Travis. Because it, it'll be fun half your room. Yeah, when we get done, it'll be fun. All right, this is it. All right, it's fun half your room. I'm really liking these little pink tails. <laughs> Travis, Bridget, Dixie. Big brother, can we please have some sort of an animal in here, please? Could we get a little puppy? But I think everyone misses their animals from home. Even a pig. <gasps> yeah, a miniature pig. A pig would be funny. Would be good. And we could sleep, he could come in the bed too. It is my pig, so we can put it into bacon. In the absence of pets, are there any items in the house you take particular comfort in? Well, I have one regular teddy bear. We named it, we decided to call it BB. Beautiful, Beautiful bear. bear. And it's like Big Brother. And then I have a unicorn toy and its name is Princess Sparkle, and I can't sleep without them. Yeah, it'll be a good time with it. Sparkles. And then I'll get a stash in time. Oh, that's a long period. Why don't I just go and stash him in my locker now? Yeah, and then bring it out. Yeah, and I'm just going to just grit it out for a piss. Rima, Rima, my best friend. This is great. This is great. Audacity. Audacity.
Audacity. Yeah, it means, um, how, what does it mean again? <laughs> Audacity, it just means rude. Like, if you Not were to... Not rude, like, um, how dare you? Yeah, like, this is how you would use it. Or how could you have the audacity to speak to me in that way? Yeah. Oh, my God, are you for real? I'd rather just be like... Oi, who are you to speak to me like that? <laughs> <laughs> Oi, who are you? Oi. Oi, get up your high horse. Who are you? You are not good. Don't you speak to me like that. I reckon we start maybe... Audacity. Can, I reckon, do you, you want to go with audacity? audacity or do you want to go with something... No, I like the word, but I don't know how... I'll have to get into an argument to you. <laughs> yeah, oh, I'm sure you will. <laughs> I'm sure I'm you will. I'm going to go out there and start trouble. Yeah, do it. Problem child. <laughs> and Brecky. Give us another word, shoot. I don't want to overload you, man. Go, no, give me give me one. Critique. 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 Like quit C R I T. Critique. 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 I, I can say that one better. Oh, <laughs> does it mean? Critique. It's to analyse or um, critique. It's to judge something. If I was to critique that um, those rings, I would say those rings are symbolic of the Olympics that are going to be held in Beijing this year, and that they represent that. We've lost her. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've lost her. Okay, it maybe... my eyes gone. What? That just says nothing about the Olympics to me. That's yeah. just funky art. <laughs> I can just walk up and go, that looks cool. <laughs> Is that me being cryptic? No, that's you being simple. Oh, <laughs> that's me being simple. I like that. No, that's, that's you being simple. <laughs> <laughs> the boys minus Travis have formed a clique that meets regularly in the spa. They call themselves the Spa Mafia, and this morning two of its henchmen, Ben and Saxon, are off to tell Big Brother... A Critique. 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 Like, Critique. 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 They represent that. We've lost her. <laughs> well, we've lost her? Okay, it maybe. My eyes are going, what? That just says nothing about the Olympics to me. That's yeah. just funky art. <laughs> I can just walk up and go, that looks cool. <laughs> Is that me being cryptic? No, that's you being simple. Oh, that's me being simple. I like that. No, that's, that's, that's you being simple. <laughs> <laughs> The boys minus Travis have formed a clique that meets regularly in the spa. They call themselves the Spa Mafia, and this morning two of its henchmen, Ben and Saxon, are off to tell Big Brother about a kidnapping that they're planning. <coughs> Big Brother. Saxon, Ben, very entertaining. I'd like to record myself as MCB. Yes. This is MC Sax. What's up? Tell Big Brother about your plans for Operation Sparkle. Operation Sparkle is, is um, this was created by the Spa Mafia, and uh, it entails us somehow stealing um, one of Bridget's cherished teddy bears. What steps will your plan involve? I mean, I just broke a bit it of a decoy. I think there's going to have to be a decoy. Mm -hmm. A watch, a lookout. Maybe a bit of framing, just to. Um... It has to be framing. Whom are you planning to frame? Dixie. Yeah, mate. Fucking Dixie. 
because there seems like there's a bit of tension between them already. <laughs> there you go. Mm. Pretty light. Sorry, mate. You go here. Yeah. Oh, God. Next, the plot to pinch Princess Sparkles continues. Some sort of they're healthy though. Laxative, yeah. No, I mean like a meat like illegal to give me all this for dinner. Yeah, you can't eat it. Don't eat all sick as a dog. If no one would have swapped with me tonight, they would have pushed me over my limit. I would have went in there and requested to go home. You would not. I am I'm that dead serious. You reckon they would You can't say you would have left because of that. I probably I reckon I would have been would have Oh look, I I started crying in there. Yeah. If no one swapped with me and I was still crying, I would have went in there and said, no, nah, f*** you. I'm going. I've eaten. Did you eat? Yeah, come here. <laughs> I've got a real bad luck of run, run of luck coming. I've eaten 38 ah. prunes. My <laughs> fourth day and I've already cracked. <laughs> I can't believe I started crying about it. Yeah, I can't believe you started crying about it as well, to be honest with you. After the break, Princess Sparkles goes missing. Ah! Someone stole my unicorn. I'm sensitive like you. I would have been. I wish I didn't cry in front of everyone. Don't worry about it. No one thinks anything stupid. Don't worry. I promise you. I'm such. A, I, I don't. I'm not all that, like, I don't know. I was just hungry and I just needed a decent meal. You know this is no, no girls out here tonight wanting to play games. Mm. Yeah. Oh yeah, mate. Hmm? Bridget mightn't say anything, I don't think, if she discovers it tonight. Oh, she might not. I reckon she just might not say anything. She's got to have noticed by now. So what, what's the plan from here? Leave it all day tomorrow and all night? Oh, let's let, let the good times roll. Honestly, if Rima didn't swap with me, I would have went in there and I said, look, I'm going f you, get my stuff, I'm going. I would have went. Well, I don't want you to go. I wouldn't have let you. I would have chased you into the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 this is going to make you stronger. You feel, but do, do you feel, do you feel, still feel sick now? Yeah, I feel more sick now. Someone stole my unicorn. Bianca, Bianca and I have got bites. Yeah, it's like a bed bug or something. Who has my unicorn? 